So percutaneous ablation of the lung is where you take a needle and pass it through the chest wall and put it into the center of the tumor. Obviously, you can't blindly pass a needle into the center of a tumor, and so in those circumstances, you would use a CAT scan or some other type of imaging modality that would allow you to guide the needle as you're placing it so that you're sure it's in the center of the tumor. Once that needle's in the center of the tumor, you turn the energy source on, and it creates the freeze ball of cryotherapy, or it creates the energy source like microwave where it would treat a defined area or radiofrequency ablation where the tongs would deploy inside the center of the tumor and treat and heat that area. The goal in all ablative therapy is to kill the tumor. And sometimes you see the area with a rim of edema around the tumor. And so you wait over time and you watch with imaging to make sure that no new tumor forms. Following these patients can be quite complex, and so I recommend that if you do have ablation, you have an ablation expert also follow your CAT scans to make sure that you don't have any new tumor growing.